Hey guys, welcome back to Deepak's Daily Reading. Today we're going to be talking about high performance once again by Jake Humphreys and Professor Damien Hughes. Got a lot of notes today, so I'll share them with you. So identifying ultimately your action triggers when you, for example, have bad habits and or good habits, and then you can cue the cue stage of the habit loop. So that means when you're about to engage in a negative or a positive habit you should be mindful and aware of those things and change where it needs change and reinforce where it needs reinforcing so you can start the day with strong habit cues such as make your bed walk for 45 minutes so what i'll do each morning is i'll listen to audible and i'll walk for typically an hour which is to the mcdonald's and back fundamentally that's open in the morning i get out of the house about 4 40 a.m and head over so even if, for example, your wake-up time changes, there's strong habit cues that you should have that you can reinforce that are positive for you and for yourself. The other concept is what's done in the shadows will reveal itself in the light. So this relates to fundamentally, of course, as we all know, when you get to match day, it's all the training that you've done that will contribute to superior performance on match day and that's that concept so i like that expression what's done in the shadows will reveal itself in the light this is the other thing that i really liked about rio ferdinand for those who are aware of who rio ferdinand is he moved from west ham to leeds in part because of the london light nightlife so this is the whole concept also taken well not taken but reminiscent of willpower doesn't work. So one of the challenges was he loved partying effectively. So he, in his search for discipline, it triggered a change in behaviors and focus because he went from West Ham to Leeds as well, then on to Manchester United and so forth. And that relates to, again, helping build strong discipline and habits. And then it just mentions this concept of never miss twice. So when it comes to your behaviors, you can miss something once, but missing it twice just means it's destructive or detrimental. So one of the things that I'm definitely missing at the moment is I did say to Axel, I'll get into reading each day before bed. And I'm not, I'm struggling with the Kindle, but they're just excuses. So I'm going to re, re-look at figuring the Kindle out so I can not just listen to audiobooks and make these notes, but I can also read. So never miss twice i for reference guys read typically a chapter from a book and or 20 minutes and then i'll rotate so that was a chapter i've just read another chapter now from high performance which i'll go on to talk about in a separate voice note actually later on today perhaps